Hey there, I'm Samuel from Test Gorilla. Are you looking for a faster, easier, and more efficient way to develop apps? Then you might want to hire an expert in Docker. Docker enables developers to isolate apps into separate containers to simplify workflows and collaborate more effectively. It makes developing, running, and managing apps a breeze. And with Test Gorilla's Docker test, you'll be able to find developers who are highly skilled and experienced with this platform. Adding this test to your assessment is super simple. Just find it in our test library and hit that Add button. Before you do that though, let's jump into a quick overview of the test and learn a bit more about it. This test evaluates a candidate's ability to deploy, configure, administer, and troubleshoot Docker. It assesses candidates' skills in three core areas of the software. The first area deals with managing installation, configuration, and storage. The second area with images, and the third one with network and security. Candidates who perform well here will have plenty of practical experience with Docker and know how to use it effectively, both on their own and as part of a team. This test is perfect when hiring for DevOps managers, DevOps engineers, IT admins, and any other roles that require a strong knowledge of Docker. Now, let's take a look at a few sample questions to see how we test for these skills. The first sample question has candidates refer to the Docker file below. It asks for the best way to reduce the layers in the output Docker image. Are you a developer? Have you ever worked with Docker? If you have, try this question yourself. If you haven't, or you're not a developer, no worries. Just take this time to look over the question and the different answers. If nothing else, it'll give you a good idea of what your candidates will experience on the actual test. All right, time's up. Let's see what the answer is. The next sample question presents a common real-world scenario that deals with an online registry. The third sample question is a true or false about the supported storage driver for the newest versions of Docker. Basic questions like this are important for making sure your candidates are up to date and following best practices. And the last sample question presents a what-if scenario concerning two different images built with the same Docker file. Understanding how to best handle images in Docker digs a bit deeper into your candidate's technical knowledge and experience with the platform. And that's a quick overview of our Docker test. It should give you a good idea of what types of questions your candidates will face on the actual test. If you're looking to hire a developer who's an expert with this platform, make sure to add this test to your next assessment. 